But I think coexistence is always a negotiated process and it takes two hands to clap, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So, um, I mean, there needs to be um, this willingness to, to get past the initial barriers as well. Okay. Well, before we go on further, let me bring to your attention a, a clip, a soundbite from a, a radio listener to 938 Live Talkback Radio this morning, a caller called Joseph. Uh, he says uh, Singapore provides foreign workers with jobs, so they shouldn't expect too much. And here's uh, the radio presenter, Bharati Jagdish, responding to him. Let's listen in. So you mean if the person is coming in to do a white-collar job, they deserve better treatment than a person who is coming in to do a blue-collar job? Because, you see, they study hard, you know, they have the certification, they are doing a different contribution to Singapore. Don't you, you think, though, that what migrant workers do is just as important? It is important, but the thing is, these people come from a different part of the world. We are a first-world country. You know, it's not really very nice to have people in our MBS, you know, in our WS. They are, you know, indirectly hurting the image of our beautiful place. I, I mean, understand I what you mean, but they also helped build the beautiful place. Pei Hun, yep. okay. your reactions to this? Yeah, I'm not sure, I mean, how many people subscribe to this view, but I've heard and read quite a lot of this online. Uh, the root of this is discrimination. I mean, the, we somehow feel that because they are not just a different colour, but uh, that they are poor, they are low-wage migrant workers, they're most likely not very well educated, that therefore they deserve something lesser. But my question is, what is the basis for deciding that they deserve something lesser? If we look them in the eye, are they not just as human as we are? And also, I mean, to respect someone else is really to respect yourself, isn't it? I mean, what is it to be a first world country if we don't know how to treat someone like what a first world country is supposed to? So, sorry, you know, I thought that there was this recreation centre, you know, I thought it would be good as an alternative, mm -hmm. but always as an alternative. Okay. Yeah.